They helped defeat Nazism, only to be massacred by those they fought for. This is the story of West African soldiers who were betrayed by France. The atrocity took place at the Tiaroy military transit camp in Senegal. Over a thousand West African soldiers had been repatriated there after years battling the Germans on French soil. They had been recruited from various colonies and were known as les tirailleurs or the skirmishers. On December 1st, 1944, they started demanding the withheld pay and bonuses for their participation in the war. The French army's response was swift and brutal. It rounded up all the unarmed men in a courtyard and opened fire. The military tried to cover up the incident by claiming it was a heavily armed rebellion. And it made false claims about a hostage situation to justify its use of lethal force. Years later, doubling down, France banned the film, lifting the lead on what had happened. The exact number of people killed that day is still disputed. At first, grudgingly France admitted 35. Later, after François Hollande visited Senegal, this was raised to 70. However, Africans claimed the true death toll could be as high as 400. The families of victims pleaded for the archives to be opened. This eventually happened, but the experts have found nothing. What's worse for the families though, is that they cannot bury their loved ones. The mass graves in which the betrayed war heroes are buried have never been located. 